Hey everyone, it's Roman Rich here today in Gallup, New Mexico. Now that's a significant part of Route 66, so significant in fact that it's named in the Route 66 song. Get your kicks on Route 66. So uh, today I'm in a room, I'm in the third level, room 312, and uh, I'm shooting a 360 video, which I haven't done in a while but this place is so cool that I thought I would do a 360 video because that way all the roadies out there like you can explore on your own so if you don't know what a 360 video is you can take on your mobile device and kind of pinch and move and do things like that if you're looking at it on a computer you use your mouse you can use your mouse to move around and you can see anything 360 degrees that this camera picks up on uh, if you're watching this on a smart TV, I have no idea. If you know how to do that, leave a comment below for us all so we can figure it out because I haven't a clue. Uh, while you're doing stuff, in fact, uh, be sure to like the video, subscribe if you're not one of my subscribers already, and above all, share it everywhere because this is a cool video. And whenever I see people sharing my stuff, it encourages me to make more videos and that makes everybody happy everyone's a winner then so be sure to do that and if you want to catch some of my other stuff I post very often on Facebook so uh, what do you say we kind of get started we're here in my room right now looking around here is mr. Jose Ferrer a picture of him he's a famous movie star and this is a very very small room uh, they have bigger rooms but this is a small one this time but very cool is the shower in the bathroom now it's small it's tiny but it's really 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 nice and it looks like they've just remodeled it and they didn't do just a simple remodel job they did a nice remodel job and, and tried to stay true to form with the historic nature of the motel hotel I should say of the hotel and they used some really good quality products the sink and, and the toilet and the mirrors and the tile and all the fixtures look very high quality. And uh, something I noticed, I just washed my hands a little bit ago, they use very high quality soap made in Italy and it doesn't dry your hands out. Uh, I washed my hands just a little bit ago and my hands are not drying out, which is very important when you're in New Mexico. If you're planning a trip on Route 66 and you're gonna go through Texas, New Mexico, Arizona, you better bring lots of lotion because you're gonna dry out, my friend. In addition to that, bring lots of Q-tips because there's lots of dirt and stuff floating in the air. All right, what I have for you is a quick little tour of the El Rancho Hotel. Okay, again, we're on level three. And make sure I got my key before I close my door. Yep, I do. Okay. Got my key. Now, there's lots of little murals and things like that all through the hallways and every room is named after a different Hollywood TV star and most likely a Western movie TV star, Western movie star like John Wayne or Ronald Reagan, um, anyone along those lines. So third floor, the special treat I have for you is the, uh, well, I was going to take you down the elevator but somebody's going down there. so. I'm going to walk down the stairs and then I will bring you up the elevator because it's not just a normal elevator. It is one of those unique elevators where you slide the door open and the, and the screen and the cage and you press the button and you can see all the stuff, the internals are working uh, in the elevator. I've never been in one like that before and it's pretty cool. So here's the second level of the lobby of the El Rancho. And you can see everything is ornate. The furniture, the decorations, the structures, everything is western ornate and beautiful. So we're just walking along here and we have tons of Hollywood memorabilia posted on the wall. It's really cool. We're going to walk out on the balcony. 
which I've never done before either. Lots of new experiences. You know, even though I've stayed here probably a dozen or more times over the last 15 years, I've never been out on this balcony before. You can see the place is pretty full tonight. Pretty neat. I can sit back, relax, rock in the rocking chair, and just look at all the cool stuff going by on Route 66 out here in front of the El Rancho Hotel. Now later on tonight, the place will be lit up with neon and it'll be absolutely amazing. It'll be stunning looking. It's got this beautiful pink magenta glow. It's really cool. There's nothing like it on Route 66. All right, back inside. For an added bonus, if you look down there, there's a Hollywood celebrity, Jan Carl. Wave, Jan. Wave hi. Hey. Wave hi to all the people on YouTube. Hey, everybody on YouTube. That's, that's right. That's Jan Carl with Small Town Big Deal. That's right. And then down there is Rodney Miller. He's checking his email. Guys, you got to check them out. They're on a TV show called Small Town Big Deal. And they also have a YouTube channel, too. So check them out in both places. All right. We're going to go finish the tour of the second level of the lobby. And again, spin your screen around, look around, watch this video three or four times. You never know, you might see something different. And I'll go in and out, like I'm flying like an airplane here. All sorts of neat stuff. Old telephones, Betty Grable, she stayed here. And that's the thing about the El Rancho. All the big Hollywood movie stars stayed here, especially the Western movie stars. They all stayed here. They all have autographed uh, portraits on the wall. Just really cool. Hi. Okay, we're going to go down the stairs. I'll take you around through the lobby a little bit. You'll see big chandeliers, longhorn steers, old cigarette machines. One of my favorite things over here is the player piano, and I haven't seen it work for a long time. They did. The player piano is supposed to be automatic, and it'll play a song for us. Maybe we'll check that out later. going to invade the set of Small Town Big Deal for a moment yeah. behind the scenes. Here we are working away. And uh, check out the fireplace. We should throw a log on there, shouldn't we? Yeah, there was one. Okay, let's we'll throw a little bit of... He offered to do it. We said it's not in our shop right now. Can we get out of our shop? That's, that's Roger. He's the big meanie of Small Roger. Town Big Deal. Yeah, now you're grumpy, Roger. Um, He's just jealous because he doesn't know how to fly a drone, even though he has a license. Or on a camera. Or on a camera. <laughs> but he does want to change a flat tire. He knows how to run over nails and change flat tires. Yeah, I'm all right. <laughs> all right. I'm going to get out of this shot. I'm going to take you guys over to the elevator, which is kind of the highlight of my day. I've never taken the elevator here before. Oh, want some cigarettes? Come to Marlboro country. You never know what you're going to see here. All sorts of cool stuff. All right, we're going to press the button. Hopefully the elevator's coming down. Don't make me a liar. Elevator. Oh, I think it's coming. I hear it. I hear it. Oh, it's loud. While we're waiting, let's see. I think it's here now. Nope, not here yet. It's still locked. Might be stuck. These old pictures. 1936, 38, 42. Let me see what's up with this elevator. No, it's still locked. We may have to go upstairs and grab it. find the elevator. Okay, we're going to 
fire in the elevator. It's someplace. Look at him. Look at him. Here's Rodney. Here, hold on just a second. I can see a little, a little piece of that light. Is that believable? What does it mean? So, home of old movie stars and modern movie stars. Let's see if I can catch it from the second floor. Let's try this. Oh, it's opening. Here it is. We found it. Okay. So, all right, I'll hold this back so you guys can see. I gotta close this door. Look at that door. Wow. That's crazy. Gotta close this. Just gonna latch this, I believe. I'm not sure. I'm just gonna hold it right there. I'm gonna press three. Watch it. We're gonna go up. Check that out. Here goes the tube. You see the brick? Now we're up to three. Okay. Not gonna open the door. We're around number one. Okay. Let's see. Maybe what's with that? Elevator difficulties. Operator error. Okay, now it reset. So you can kind of see the door goes in there, opens. Put that all the way again. We hit number one. I don't know what that button's for down there. I want to press that button. What do you think? Better not. Better not press the button. Going back down. It's just so neat. You got this cage here. This is a super old school hotel. Nowhere else on Route 66 will you see this. Pretty awesome. All right, down here we're gonna close the fence. Open the fence. Is it open or close? Close it. Open. I'm not sure. I want to move the fence out of the way. Now I'm gonna open the door. Well, there it is. Back down on the first floor. So that's the hotel rancho. I'm gonna go outside. You guys can see it from the bottom floor outside. Photo bombing Rodney Miller again. One day I'm gonna be popular like Rodney Miller. Okay. All right. So straight out from the El Rancho into the front parking lot. You'll notice as you look around, you'll see their sign. The sun's starting to go down. I'll have some other video here at the end of this showing the neon glow of everything. I probably won't be saying much, but at the end of this video, I'll show the neon stuff. Um, neon's on on the front. I only see a couple tubes on on the sides. Hopefully it's functional. Last time I was here, it was functioning very good. But the Hotel Motel sign up top is not on. Yeah, and it's weird because I just noticed that if you look at the H, it also has an M in there. There's a, there's the H, but there's a neon H, and then there's a neon M on top of it. I've never noticed that before. So maybe it flip-flops from Hotel Motel, and I just have forgotten. But that's the El Rancho Hotel Motel, home of the stars. Home of the YouTubers like me, Touring Route 66. I'm Roman Rich. Get your kicks on 66. Tell me some of your ideas on videos I should do next down in the comments below. Make sure you share the video. I always love that. And hit subscribe. As always, go your own way. See you guys down the road.